Hi guys. It's uh, a slightly different Sunday. It's the kind of Sunday where I'm not cooking. However, there is a child's birthday party taking place. They're always at our house. Instead of, I think, I think it's, they always say, well, your house is bigger. I think it's uh, more a case of, you can do the cleaning up. <laughs> now, to be honest, it's actually more a case of, it's, it's easier from the wife's point of view. Um, but I think they have got into sort of like a, a bit of a habit with it. But I mean, it's, yeah, it's all good means that you know we get to see the kids super excited and screaming uh, although I think two of them aren't coming so I'm not sure although they have just come back from uh, they're not long back from one of those uh, it looks like an outward bound center at Doncaster it's like a school trip the school took them there for three days and they were only back on Friday night so but uh, I had a bit of a rough night last night. The wife had me up twice. Um, so a bit headachey actually. Didn't get up till quite late. Uh, but uh, now I've just been and picked up a few bits for the party that, you know, just like some party style biscuits. Bottle of milk, because apparently the kids like milk, but I don't think we'll use all we've got at home, to be honest. Uh, but the, it's all done basically. The new sofa's arrived, as some of you will know. Those of you that follow my Twitter feed will know that uh, we've got the new sofa and chair. Because I, I won't say suite because it wasn't picked as a suite. Because uh, we've got one chair which is like a rise and recline for the wife. Uh, although it was more the recline side of things that we needed than anything else. Um, And the sofa was one that I picked and I picked it based more on its comfort. It is a nice looking sofa but I got it more based on its comfort. Uh, and I said because to me that that is more important than having something that looks pretty. You know. Uh, it's got to be functional, and if it's not comfortable, it's not functional. So, <clears throat> yeah, I got this one, and I, I practically fell into it. The one, <laughs> I mean, they had like the the four seater version out of the showroom, um, which is the one I actually sat on. Now, obviously, this needs a little bit of wear into it yet. It's not quite it's, it's a high softness level. It is one of those that you've got to plump up all the time after you've sat on it. Um, but it's a very deep and luxurious material sofa uh, and of course the wife went and picked all like the the bits and pieces to help tie it all into the colour and what have you so you know she's picked like the teal curtains and some some teal scatter cushions to go on it that help blend it all into the uh, into uh, the colour on the wall of course but it's all looking nice very nice now that we've got everything sort of in there and more or less finished. I've still got some bits and pieces I've got to do. I mean, it's like where our old TV sat. I've got the big one from the bedroom in there now, but that needs um, a top creating for it now. Out of some MDF, you know, a corner shaped top. Um, because this TV, of course, even if I took it off its stand, wouldn't fill to the front edge of this thing which never had a top on you see because I had the old plasma screen that sat on some brackets lined up with the edge of the cupboard so anyway now I've just got to sort out that was a clever move lady bad driving there's nothing like bad driving to make me make a person growl is there so um hope you're all having a good weekend or had a good weekend actually it was when I came down it was absolutely glaring 
red hot in the car. I mean, it's what, we're only 11 degrees outside. Um, and it is quite cloudy around and about, but by God, when that sun's out, it is bright. So we're definitely uh, starting to get slowly towards a British summer. I'll call it a British summer. I won't call it summer because, of course, we all know what British summer can be. <laughs> we do if you come from Britain anyway. But um, yeah, it's pretty cloudy today actually. And I, I was going to try maybe some time lapse, but with my with a camcorder. I've got a camcorder that you can put into time lapse, but it's very limited on how often it takes the uh, the photograph. But I thought I'd give it a try. I was uh, been interested in trying it out for a while and never really had the chance. But of course, moving clouds make for a good time lapse. So if I get one done, I'll throw it in here. Or maybe after I get home. Yeah, if I get a time lapse done, I'll put it in when I get home. Um, so yeah, no cooking today. I'm hoping to get some videos in this afternoon, although I haven't got my mother and my auntie coming round. Because my auntie's over from Liverpool. Uh, saw last night at uh, another party that just I went to actually in the end the wife wasn't feeling up to it her blood sugars are just off the scale at the minute uh, so she's not she's not very well at all to be honest but she's uh, I know she's been sort of up in her chair this morning helping her uh, with her carer doing the food for the party uh, left me lying in bed but yeah I went to uh, it was my sister-in-law's now she's had it early it's not actually our birthday until next week, but it's, uh, it's her, it was her 50th, so she's actually, she's now, until next year, a year older than me. It's, it's a running joke that we've always had, because whenever I, my, whenever I turned my birthday, it made me numerog numerologically at the same age as her. So she, you know, she always used to say, how old are you now, Bob? <laughs> now I'd say, not for long. Because it's only like, a, sort of, just over a month later and it's her birthday, so. But yeah, she's just, uh, she's just rolling 50 actually next week when she had the, the party last night. Yeah, it was very nice actually, if, uh, if it, uh, you know, if the, if I didn't sort of like need to sort of get back and be there for the wife and stuff like that, then you know I could quite happily have stayed longer. It was it was uh, said to be a nice party. Yeah, so I only had like one drink early on and then just drank coke and had some food and what have you, and uh, then said me goodbye. So, but uh, oh, somebody's parked in the bloody way. The wife's carer. <laughs> And my mother's here with my auntie, so that's that. That's, uh, yeah, that sun's coming out strong now. Ooh, feels nice. Uh, temperature's actually just dropped half a degree, it's ten and a half now. <laughs> Even though the sun's just come out. Right, so I'll catch up in a bit, guys. seconds originally but it was running a bit too fast so you know I'll, uh, I'll pop it in anyway I'm just sort of enjoying a bit of messing around at the minute just trying lots of different settings and stuff like that you know uh, it's something that I've never really had time to do but uh, the party went down all right anyway it was uh, yeah but uh, everything sort of started happening, you know, as soon as I got back from town, that was it. So, you know, I haven't had time at all. I mean, it's now like seven o'clock. 
so not really had time to do anything much so it's getting quite chilly out as well so um but yeah it's been the party was all right like, you know but we had all the kids here and lots of screaming and complaining and a bit of crying and i've still got some bits and pieces to put away actually like the slide that they got out and stuff like that they never put anything away it's uh I've got a bit of help putting the, some of the mess away in the house, but I was going to show you my new sofa and everything, but uh, still people sat around in there that obviously don't want to be on camera or anything, so I'll get it in next vlog maybe. Uh, tomorrow I'm off, I'm taking my eldest daughter to hospital, just having an um, endoscopy done. Uh, and she's not allowed to drive afterwards because obviously they numb your throat and stuff don't they and sometimes they have to anaesthetise so yeah so I'll be picking her up early afternoon and running her through to Scarborough it's always uh, something going on something that uh, inflicts on life I suppose but um, you know it's like I wanted to get all like these review videos done. I've got about four or five I need to do for headphones and what have you. Is it one, two, four? Four, I think. And then I've got a Bluetooth speaker on the way as well, and just some other bits and pieces. So, yeah, it's uh, it's keeping me busy anyway. But I just wish I got a bit more time of my own to do them sometimes. Uh, it's like today I was hoping to get the grass done, <laughs> you know, that's gone out the window, it just, and it starts to snowball doesn't it, but uh, I'll get there, it just <laughs> takes time, you know, there's always something that gets in the way of your plans, you know, you can, it doesn't matter how well you lay your plans, something will always uh, get in the way. But yeah, I'm going to give that a few minutes and what have you. I mean, what's that? One every second. Uh, so, 30 seconds will give you a second of footage. I'm hoping to get, I don't know, maybe somewhere between 10 and 20 seconds, something like that. So, needs to be there a few minutes yet. So, anyway, I'm going to pop inside where it's warmer. Have a drink and then I'll come back out and get in. All right, guys. So the wife's watching telly. Well, she's snoring actually. <laughs> um, I've just been picking up some more of the party food, you know, all the sausage rolls, stuff like that. Um, but uh, no, nah, just started editing this vlog actually, and it's just. It's just been such a lackluster day for me, guys. Um, and then people wonder why I'd rather be at work sometimes. Oh. But, um, yeah, I've, I've just been messing around, sort of speeding up and what have you with that bit of time lapse footage and what have you. And, uh, I'm just going to wait, it's rendering at the minute. I've finished importing what's been done apart from this piece here now, of course. Um, but I notice, like, the Mac actually uh, renders stuff much slower that's come from the iPhone than it does that's come off the camcorder. So it's obviously the format, like. But you would have thought it'd be the other way around, wouldn't you? You would have thought that with Apple devices, the footage would render quicker on another Apple device than a device that's come from, you know, a, a Panasonic camcorder. So, yeah, it's a bit strange, really. Um, but it is so much better on that big screen, you know, guys. Just, it's just, you know, you can see things much more clearly and what have you. You know, you can see more of your timeline and all that sort of thing. So... It is far better. Um, oh, that TV uh, is here. Uh, 
and uh, it actually looks um, I was going to do an unboxing but we wanted to sort of get it in and get it sorted you know because we've been trying to get everything sort of sorted and what have you got loads of IO on the back um, what's it got three or four USB ports three HDMI's uh, I was just there's just loads of stuff and one of, and it uh, it'll auto record as well to uh, one of the one of the USB ports I've plugged a hard drive into it uh, one that we've got with some movies on and what have you and you can auto record to that if you press record the program you're watching that's on screen at that moment will record to the hard drive so that's a nice little touch as well um, one of the things I haven't shown to the wife yet if you're in YouTube on your phone and you press the little uh, button at the top it automatically flips it over to the TV screen and it's pretty quick as well actually but um, yes yeah, it's, it's one thing is it's actually um, it's not as tall as the other TV was but the other TV had a large black board around it it's difficult to get your head around how it looks so this looks a lot smaller but it's actually about three quarters of an inch bigger corner to corner but the other one of course wasn't um, a 16.9 whereas this one is this one's a true 16.9 HD so it's, it's strange how it sort of like plays with your eyes you know but this has got this tiny little silver border that runs around it so but um, yeah it's a, it's a nice TV it gives quite a nice picture and what have you you know um, I'm happy with it and the wife's happy with it and that's all that matters at the end of the day the Bluetooth's a bit of a pain in the ass that it wouldn't connect to uh, the headphones like I wanted it to so but um, you know uh, I suppose on this one the port is actually easier to get to so it's not so bad leaning over and just plugging something in and out for the headphones like so you know it's not, it's not that's not quite so bad so it's still doable in a way you know but um, yeah anyway guys I'm gonna get off anyway and I'll finish getting this sorted uh, I mean what time is it now it's half past eight so I'm gonna get that done but yeah yes uh, last night was a killer with a couple of wake-ups early this morning and what have you so but anyway yeah uh, it's another weekend over and uh, well, I've still got tomorrow off, of course, to run my door up to the hospital. We'll have to see how things go with that. Um, and then uh, I can get back to work, where it's more peaceful. But, um, yeah, uh, I'm going to end it here, guys. So do take care of yourselves. Have a good week. And I'll see you all next time. Cheers guys, see ya.